Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're part of the family, if you're new here, thank you so much for stopping by, consider subscribing. Um, yes, as you guys can see from the title, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I style my curly hair and how I style my daughter's curly hair. And I'm gonna show you in her hair because she just got out of the shower right now and I was like, huh, I could totally just turn on the camera and film this because this is how I do her hair every like two to three times a week. I don't wash her hair every day. I wash it like every three, maybe every four days because we put a lot of products on her hair and it's just a lot when we dry it and when we style it. So um, that's what we're gonna do today in this video. How I'm gonna style her hair is how I style my curly hair whenever it's curly. If you have been following me for a while, you know that I'm actually trying to grow out my hair. I wear it straight a lot and it's like up to here, right? And I have it curly right now, but it's up in a bun. It's a little dirty. Anyways, so I'm gonna show you how I style my curly hair by styling my daughter's because she has my type of hair and it's really, really long and it's beautiful and that is why I wanted to grow out my hair because I want to look like her. So I'm gonna ask her to come in here, go around, go around the lights. Actually, no, over here is good. And we're in her room, which is where I film. I film like right across from here. It's like this little corner in her room because that's the only space I have to film. Thank you for letting me borrow your room to film. <laughs> so we're in the other side of where I film, which is where her bed is at. So we are right here. Thank you for letting me film in your room. You're welcome. All right. So show me your room real quick. This is her bed. And this is her nightstand. And this is her. <laughs> All right, come over here. And she's in her PJs because she just got off. She just got out of the shower and she's about to, you know, we're gonna go do some like family games and stuff, but I still have to do her hair. So she literally just got out of her, she literally just got out of the shower and her hair is like dripping wet, okay? <laughs> so, I'm gonna walk you through all the products that I use on her hair and on my hair. These are the four things that you're going to need if you wanna do this in your curly hair. So first, it's a brush, okay, or like a paddle brush right here that we got at like the dollar store. You don't need to like spend a million dollars on this. Mm -hmm. You don't. Okay. And the next thing is a leave-in conditioner. We have tried a lot, right? A lot of leave-in conditioners. And that one's the, the best one. This is the found. one that we love. And this is not even a leave-in conditioner. This is just mm -hmm. a regular conditioner mm -hmm. that we got at a sample. Like we got a little sample of it and we fell in love with it. And it's the Maui Moisture Heal and Hydrate Shea Butter, yeah, a mouthful, conditioner for dry damaged hair, okay? It's silicone free. It's supposed to be, the guys are outside, sorry. Uh, it's made with 100% aloe juice. It's vegan, eco-friendly, pure coconut water, pure aloe juice, no SLS, no gluten, no paraben, no silicones, no nothing. It's natural, meaning we could probably eat this. Yes. We're not gonna eat it though. And I have damaged hair. She has beautiful hair. Anyways, okay, so apparently this got an award by People Magazine. There we go. So Maui, that's what it looks like. And we got this at Walmart. I think this cost like six or seven dollars. I think. Either way, I'll put a link below so where you guys, where you guys can purchase it. Okay. So the first thing is for oh, so you need this, your leave-in conditioner or your conditioner. You're also gonna need some mousse. We do put a light layer of mousse to give it some crunch. Okay. And it doesn't make your hair poofy. Yes. Come here. Thank you. <laughs> speak to. You can't speak to the the screen. You gotta speak to the camera. Got it? Right here, in the middle. And then we have a spray bottle um, with water in it because sometimes, by the time I have to do her hair after she showers, it could be a few minutes and her hair could start getting dry. And with curly hair, rule number one is you do not style it dry. Because if not, it's gonna get... How? I don't know. Puffy, you just said it, puffy. Uh, it's gonna get all puffy and frizzy, so we don't want that. So you always style curly hair when it's... Wet. Wet, okay, stand up. So, I'm just gonna spray just a little more on top. Oh my gosh, hopefully the water's not getting to the mic. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, Lucia, look at me. You're gonna stand right there. Just stand straight, okay? Mm -hmm. So first things first, we're gonna put in, put your conditioner or your leave-in conditioner. Whoop. About that amount. 
And I'm going to put this all over her hair. Stop looking at yourself. You put something in my forehead. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe your forehead needs hydration too. Yeah. <laughs> all right, there we go. Now her hair is really curly and it tends to get a lot of knots. That's why I only comb it or I brush it out with a conditioner because not, if not, I'll break her hair. There's been times where I've had to like cut her hair because she has knots. Oh, no, not bueno. Okay, so now I'm gonna do it this side so you guys can see it. So now I'm gonna start, I parted her hair. Turn around. I parted her hair halfway, kind of. And we're going to, look straight, don't look at the camera. We're going to start combing her hair starting from the bottom, okay? Just like this. That way when you get to a knot, you brush it down and you're already brushing it through already combed out hair and it's just easier to comb it out. You see? Take your time. Anything else you want to tell me? If you're rushing, me? your hair gets, like, I don't know, puffier. You're so wise, you're so wise. So hopefully my hair looks like this by the end of 2019. That is my goal. Yes. To have my hair long and curly like this beauty over here. All right, so we are done with the first half. Now you're gonna turn around this way, just like that. And we're gonna do this side. Oh, sorry, we're gonna start from the bottom. Look how beautiful this hair is. Look how beautiful. Oh, I love it. Can we change hairs? No. Can you give me your hair right now? I'll give you mine. No, because they can't take our, our hair. Oh, that's right. Because it's stuck on our head. It's stuck on our head, I know. Sorry. I love moose. I love moose. Okay, so we are done with the second half, and now we're gonna join them together. Hold on, stay over here. And you're going to brush right through them. Just like this. And I love it because then her hair always has conditioner in it to make it nice and soft and hydrated. Okay, look up, Lucy. This way. And then we're gonna comb right through it. Ow. Sorry. So look at her hair now, it's so pretty. It's so long. Go straight. I actually cut her own hair. Um, I've never had her hair cut by somebody else. I'm the one who cuts it. So next time I trim it, I'll let you guys know, or I'll film it, I'll let you guys know. I'll film it for you guys. But look at her hair right now is short and you can't even, like the screen doesn't even reach that low. It's like all the way, there we go, down here. Cause curly hair is like that, look at that. Wow, wow. So, when it starts getting a little longer, then I'm gonna trim it. And I actually cut her hair in layers. So pretty. But you see how much hair falls off? Because you're styling it so often, so that's why we don't wash it that often. Look at this. <gasps> Lucia, you're going bald. This is all Lucia's hair. Look at this. And it always goes back. Yeah, it goes back. But because we're, we have to style it like this, Every time we style it, we lose a lot of hair. So that's why we can't style it like every day because she will be bald by the end of the week. Ew. Okay, so then <laughs> now at this point, you can style the hair and do however you want. We've done pointy tails. We've done like pick, like, um, we've done like pointy tails like this. We've done like buns. We've done like half up, half down. But today we're just gonna do it down. Today we're just gonna do it down because we're gonna show them how it is that you do it down. Because once it's down and it dries and you got those beautiful curls, then you can put it up in a bun and you can do stuff like that. That kind of styling you could do. But brushing styling on like curly hair, tell them no. No way, Jose. 
Tell them. No way, Jose. No way, Jose. All right. All right, so our very last step is mousse. We have been using this mousse since she was a baby. Well, not a baby, a toddler, which is a Pantene um, mousse for curly hair. And I think this costs like five bucks. It's really cheap. And it gets the job done. It doesn't leave like white flakes. And we're not even gonna put that much. We're gonna put enough just to give her like a little crunch to her hair, right? And we put it too much. I know, we put too much, it gets really, really hard. But a little, a little hard with the one. We can't brush it. Or yeah, style you're not supposed it. to. Oh, style it. You're not supposed to brush dry hair. I know. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you how much we're gonna put for her whole hair, okay? Wow! <laughs> that looks like. No! No! This looks like whipped cream. I could so eat this right now. Okay. So, we're literally just gonna put one thin layer in her whole hair. Turn around. Wow. And my hair is gonna turn right. Yes. If you work by sections, you see? All you want is just one thin layer on the top. Turn around. Look straight. No, no, look straight, look straight. I gotta get up. Okay. Go this way, here we go. So in the front. Just make sure you cover her whole hair. I might put just a little more. Just, just put a little more. No, put it my hand. You're gonna do it? Come here, because they can't see you. Here we go. Whoa. Just a little more. Put it in your ends. Put it in your ends. Okay. okay. Where are my ends? Your ends are like here. These are your ends. There you go. Don't drop any on the floor. Oopsies. Wow, wow. <laughs> I don't know It's in your foot. It's in your foot. <laughs> your foot is white. <laughs> yes, my feet is white. All right, do the rest of your ends. Do the rest of your ends. And put too much on my ends. Yes. And too much on my feet. <laughs> I fell. Oh, that looks so what cool. I do is that like, I brush it off to the side like this. And then? All right, so just like this. Now, if this was my hair, I would dry it with a diffuser, okay? Like, I've done it to her before, but she does not like the hair dryer. No. No, she doesn't. Because the deal with curly hair is if you let it dry by itself, which we're gonna do it, you know, in her case, it's going to shrink. It'll like, this is how long it is, but then when it dries, it'll be like up to here. And she doesn't mind that. Um, but how I do it is that at this point I will dry with a blow dryer using a diffuser and the curls will look beautiful. If only you would let me do that, it would be amazing. One day. One day. Okay, okay. All right. so next as time far... maybe wash your hair okay. and I wash my hair. So as far as styling, we're done, okay? What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you, maybe tomorrow we'll show them how it looks in the morning. You want to do that? and how we like restyle it. Cause tomorrow morning, mm -hmm. it'll be a little like shrunk a little bit. All we have to do is spray water, right? Spray water and it'll be enough cause she has enough product in her hair now that we don't have to put anymore, okay? If we see it starts getting a little frizzy, then maybe we'll put a little like mousse and stuff. But for the most part, she should be good until we wash it again, all right? So maybe tomorrow we'll do that. Do you wanna do it tomorrow morning when you wake up? Let me know and we'll show them how it looks like. In the morning? Yeah. Before I start school? Maybe after you do your first class in school. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. So that is how we, or I, style curly hair and how I style my daughter's hair. All right? All you need is those four products and you should be good to go. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Good morning. So it is Friday morning. We did this Thursday night. And here we go. So, this is Lucia's hair. Let's take this out. This is how it looks like now. I told you guys it would shrink, and it did, just because she does not let me blow dry it. If you blow dry it when it's wet, it'll stay long. But Lucia will not let me. I'll let you next time. Next time? Really? I guess when she becomes a teenager and she wants it nice and long, no, then she'll let I me too. Let next time when you wet her, when my Okay, wet then why are we doing this video now? We gotta do it next time when you let me wet it. It's all good, it's all good. Okay, so then at this point what I do, since she doesn't let me, oh wait, we need more light. What's going on with the lights here? 
So what I do at this point, right? I mean, it's nice. The curls are nice and soft because of the lotion, but it's still put together. Lotion? Not the lotion, the conditioner. <laughs> But it still has a little bit of texture and definition because of the mousse. Look how beautiful this is. I'm just saying, like, look at this. Let's zoom in. Look how beautiful these curls are. Right? Look at this. I want this on my face. I want this right here, like this. Can you give me your hair? Mm -mm. Why? Because it's stuck on my head. <laughs> so then how I re re revelite, what is it? How do I... So how I revitalize, 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 is that a word? Um, her curls is by just adding water, okay? Because that way it'll bring out the mousse and the conditioner. And if it still is a little too poofy and uh, frizzy, <laughs> then I'll put a little bit more of mousse. Why are you laughing at me? <laughs> um, okay, so there's a redo, it's just spray it down. That's all you do, get a bottle of water. Turn around. I have her cover, I cover her face. Is the camera getting wet? Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. Yeah, no touch, thank you. And that's it, and I just run my fingers through it, right? And that way it'll lengthen out a bit. The curls, it'll lengthen it out. Why are you putting that face? The light is on my face. Oh, I'm sorry. The light is on your face? Now, Lucia's hair is layered. Can you see how layered it is? So pretty. Beautiful. And now we're gonna put this on. Like this. How do you put it on? Like that? Mm -mm. <laughs> Freaking show much better you didn't put it in the back. Because then it will go down. You're so smart. You put it in the front. Oh, sorry, you put it in the front. All right, guys, and that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Again, I would love to know just different techniques and how you guys do your curls. So you can let us know, so maybe we can try something different, <laughs> okay? And as um, Lucia gets older and older, she's gonna start doing a lot of these steps by herself. Ow. She styles her hair, her own hair now, which sometimes I tell her not to comb through it when it's dry, and she still does. And then her hair ends up like this. That's how it, how my hair can go. Yeah, it does sometimes. <laughs> All right, guys, that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys, and we will see you in our next video. Say bye. <laughs> bye. Stop laughing. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> Shh, Poppy's working. Mm. All right, Lucy has to go back to school now. Go. <laughs> bye. <laughs> oh I'm gonna pause the video, or the videos already keep going. It's still recording, but I'll stop it. Can you go put this in your hair? No. <laughs> Ew. Dale, go throw this out and then I'll clean everything. Oh. That's your hair. How are you like ill? That's your hair. <laughs> Hello friends. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos. It really and truly means the world to me that you guys take the time out of your busy schedule to watch my videos. Um, I want to share a few things with you guys. It won't take long at all. So here we go. All right, number one. If you guys are on Instagram, you guys should totally be following me at the address below. Um, just because I go live Monday through Friday and I do a small devotional slash Bible study anywhere from 10 to 15 minutes short and sweet just something that you guys can listen to throughout the day to really get you connected to God and to the Bible as well so go on Instagram and follow me number two um, if you don't already know I accept prayer requests so if there's anything that you want prayer over in your life let me know and I will add you to a prayer list that me and my family have and pray over every single day we have seen the power of prayer in our lives and we want to go ahead and share that with you guys so contact me via Facebook Instagram email comment below and I will go ahead and add you to our prayer list and number three, if you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe because we have so much fun here in the Simple Faith family. We talk about 
family, my kids, I do recipes, I do beauty, I do fashion, I do a little bit of everything and I love this and I love sharing my life with you guys. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button in the bottom and hit the notification bell so you can get an alert every time that I upload a new video. Alright guys, that's about it. Love you guys and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!